Hey everybody, how you doing this evening? Mark Bosley here. Yeah, yeah. How you like what I've logged into right there? Yeah, thanks for watching my my YouTube video. Okay, this evening, guys. Uh, I had thought of two really fantastic um, ideas for a YouTube video. Uh, I'll do the other one tomorrow night. It's going to be about prospecting on Facebook and how to generate traffic and leads on Facebook for free. So I just want to give you a little heads up so that you're sure to, to tune into my my uh, YouTube channel if you're subscribed to that. And if you're watching this video for the first time, it, it might behoove you, behoove you, whatever you say that, to log into my uh, YouTube channel tomorrow night and catch that right there because it's a way to generate free traffic okay but for the time being let's go ahead and get to the topic at hand here and uh, uh, this this is right here and I'm open to this page right here okay so let's begin guys I get calls all the time from traffic and leads from wherever you know from Facebook from social media from solo ads from Twitter from all over okay and about 40 percent of the time uh, the people say, Mark, how much does it cost? Or how much? Do, why does it cost so much? Or why do I have to pay to join? Or, or something, something along those lines, right there. And I just want to pull my hair out. You know, I just want to go, wow. You know, this people, this person wants to own their own business. They want to be an entrepreneur. They want to be successful. They want to be the ones calling the shots. They want to be the ones writing the checks. They want to be the boss. They want to be the go-to guy, the go-to girl, okay? But they ask the most ridiculous questions. Why do I have to pay to start or to begin, okay? So I thought, you know what? The best way I know to communicate why you have to pay something to own your own business, whether it's a brick and mortar building or online, would to be used something that we're all very familiar with, and that's McDonald's restaurants. And that's whether you eat there or not, you know about them if you're on this planet, okay? So here's what it costs to open a McDonald's restaurant, okay, guys? I'm not going to go into this, spend a whole bunch of time on this, and a lot of you people may not have any idea what it costs to open a, a McDonald's restaurant. And what I want you to think about while I'm showing you this information is how long do you think it takes McDonald's to turn a profit after they've spent all this money to open their restaurant, okay? How long does it take them to earn profit? Okay, so let's go ahead and jump down here uh, on the on the left side. Are you ready to be your own boss? I don't know. Some of you are. Most of you are not. You just want to talk about it. You want to talk about connecting with like-minded people. You don't have a clue what you're getting into. You you bought into some hype, or you bought into some bozo that was selling you some uh, a bag of uh, whatever. Okay, so let's go ahead and, and move on just a little bit. Okay. Okay, let's scroll down a little bit, guys, okay, if I can. Okay, owning a McDonald's franchise can be lucrative, but it requires a lot of cash. Cash, guys, it requires, some, that was, I mean, somebody may, is saying that it's going to require you to put up some money to start this business that we're all familiar with. We know everybody goes to McDonald's. They take their kids there, right? McDonald's is uh, uh, generates 2.5 million in annual sales, making it the second highest grossing chain in the U.S. behind Chick-fil-A. I didn't know that. I thought McDonald's was number one. Apparently, Chick-fil-A is beating them out now. Okay, so here we go. But to open a single restaurant, the company requires the potential franchisees to have liquid assets. Liquid. That means cash, baby, of 750000 thousand dollars that means they've always got that on hand for a rainy day that's what liquid means okay anyways let's go ahead and move on here a little bit okay okay let's just go startup costs which may include construction they got to build a building they've got to buy the equipment okay they got to buy the stoves the 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 grills the fryers the coke machines the milk make sh milkshake machines so they've got to have between 955,000 and 2.3 million according to McDonald's okay the total is determined by the geography and the size of the restaurant what that means is the number of people in your town okay if it's going to be you're in a town of half a million people, well, then it may not be as much, but it's still going to cost you a lot of money. Okay, um, franchises must pay forty percent of the startup cost with cash and other non-borrowed resources, while the rest can be financed. So that means almost half of a McDonald's franchise has to be cash. 
Okay, it has to be, it's a lot of money, guys. You already know that right there, okay? You ever thought about this when you go to McDonald's? What does it cost to run and open a McDonald's? It costs a lot of money, guys. So let's come on down right here, okay? In addition to those costs, McDonald's charges a $45,000 franchise fee and an ongoing monthly service fee equal to 4% of the gross sales. Franchisees must also pay rent to the company, which is a percentage of monthly sales. But you see, this whole article right here is about McDonald's paying money to whoever owns the corporate deal, you know, whoever owns the franchise, okay? These are franchisees, that's E-E-S, okay? So, let's go ahead and go down a little bit farther, and I'll go ahead and wrap this up, and I'll make the connection between McDonald's and my online business, or you joining an online business, okay? Franchisees have, extor have historically paid out 8.5% of the sales and rent costs, Though some pay as much as 12%. So they're paying, they're paying, they're paying. Why do I have to pay? Why do I have to pay? I get that question over and over. Why do I have to pay? Why does McDonald's have to pay? Why does why does uh, Wendy's, okay, McDonald's franchises uh, startup costs are similar to those to Wendy's, KFC, and Taco Bell. So you're saying those restaurants have to pay too? Why do they have to pay? Why do they have to pay? Everybody has to pay who wants to own a business, guys. Stop with that ridiculous question. Why do we have to pay? Okay, it's a stupid question. Stop it. Okay. Anyways, I want to go back up to the top right here, guys. I'm going to go back up. I'm done with that. You know what it costs to open a McDonald's. It costs a lot of money, okay? It costs a tremendous amount of money. And I'm trying to get us back over here to my Facebook page so we can talk for just a minute, okay? Guys, I was in, I got involved with an online business a few months ago. That is, this is, we're back on my page right now. Appreciate y'all right here. I, I got involved with an online multi-level marketing business uh, two or three months ago, yes, it cost me money. It cost me about seventy bucks one time, and then I have to pay a a a, a I have to buy some product. I have to buy some product from my skinny body company once a month, okay, in order to to stay a member and to be an owner and a distributor in the business, okay. So now you understand that even McDonald's, a restaurant that you're highly familiar with, you may even go there and eat. If you don't, your kids probably want to go there and play. Play. The same thing applies to my business or your business. Guys, if you're joining something that's free, you're not going to have very good results <laughs> because you're always going to be connecting with people who want free, free this, free that, free this, free that. Guys, this is not an entitlement society, okay? This is a society where an entrepreneur like yourself understands that there is an investment to be made in yourself. I'm saying, I'm going to pay my little $60 to join this thing. I'm going to pay my one-time $10 distributor fee, and then I'm going to go ahead and rock this thing, okay? Like I've been doing. I've already hit the gold rank in this business right here in just a month or two, okay? I actually hit it in about 19 days. I'm still at it trying to get to the platinum level, which is going to send me into orbit. But, yes, I have to buy a product. Here's some more of the, my product, right? Skinny Body, the Max right here, and here's the low, the... Uh, the uh, ageless cream right here. I don't know if you can see that right there. Guys, you have to buy. You have to invest in yourself. You have to invest in your products so that people understand that that uh, you believe in your products. You believe in your business and you believe in yourself. You believe that what you're doing you can make money with, okay? You believe in what the products you're providing can help people solve problems in their life. Just like McDonald's believes that selling burgers can fix hunger. Okay, it does for me. Okay, I like their milkshakes. But anyways, the point I was trying to make, guys, is there is an investment in an online business. If you're trying to join a business for free, stop asking that question because any business worthwhile is going to cost you a little bit of money. I mean, after all, I bought this computer, I bought the camera, I'm paying for the Wi-Fi, I'm paying for the lamp here, I'm paying for the phone. It's an investment, guys. You're going to invest money. Okay, but the amount of money that you that you pay to join me in my online business is a very low, low entrance fee. It's very low. That way it's economical. It'll fit your budget. And, and if you're going to give me the excuse that you can't afford it, then you don't need to be looking to, to open a business at all online or anywhere because to run a, a lemonade stand you've got to go buy the lemonade you got to go buy the sweetener you got to buy the table to set your stuff on you got to go 
you know, buy, buy the chair you're going to sit in to say, you got to invest, guys. It's an investment. Okay, you're buying products. Okay, it's the opportunity of a lifetime to be your own boss. And if you don't understand that, then you really don't need to be in business for yourself. Okay, you're not an entrepreneur. You're not like minded. You don't understand how entrepreneurship and capitalism works. There's an investment to be made. But the return on your investment in this particular business that I'm in, and you already saw it, skinny body. I love it. I'm making videos on it now, having success with it. I got paid last West Thursday. I got paid again today. It'll probably go in tonight. I think it's midnight tonight. I already saw it in my back office. I've gotten paid every week and then monthly they have commissions that go out. They have overrides. They have matching bonuses for your success and signing up other people. I mean, I, I don't understand why everybody's not joining this thing. Okay, guys? But I will put the link to my business in the description box. Guys, it won't cost you anything. This is the free part that you're always asking about. It won't cost you anything to put in your information, your real information, because what's going to happen is we're going to begin to build a team. We're going to begin to get visitors to your site for you. Okay, build a team for you. And a lot of those visitors will be people who are buying product, and you'll be earning good commission, and you haven't even joined the business yet. Okay, so you can let that thing roll on for a day or two and make some commissions and then join and boom, you're off and running. That's what we'll do for you as a free gift from Skinny Body Fiber. The power, lay, power line system will build a team for you. Okay, but I don't mean to get worked up. I just want to explain to you guys, if you want to be an entrepreneur, if you want to have success online, there's going to be some form of investment, guys. Okay, play the tape all the way through. Think about it from a boss perspective. Think about it from a professional. Think about it as an authority, okay? Don't think about it as some hype, as some get-rich-quick, some pie-in-the-sky thing, because the people that think like that will never have success. Never whether they're online or offline in some some store they won't have the, a garage sale they might have some success okay uh, maybe I don't know okay but if you want to learn how to re how to generate leads and traffic with zero cost we'll teach you that I know that's a big part of our business is generate leads and traffic okay and you will we'll teach you how to market and drive traffic to your system through YouTube's and Facebook and many other ways okay guys and that is free that is totally free you know the SBC power team that I'm a member of is just off the charts right now guys okay but I don't mean to make this video long and I do thank you so much for watching this video I just wanted to clarify that point where people keep asking me why do I have to pay you want to run a business any type of business you're gonna to have to make an investment in yourself or in the products or in the building or something guys there's some sort of investment okay man I appreciate you guys for watching my video and if I you know cranked out something that made you think well yeah that's right I do have to make an investment if I want a return you know what I mean um, like my video you know comment on my video below subscribe to my YouTube channel sh share this video if you like and guys remember tomorrow night on the next video I'm gonna teach you how to prospect for leads on Facebook for free like it says down here in this post right here, you want yeah, you want to learn how to generate leads with zero cost except for your time and how to market your skills to them. Even if you're just getting started, message me for those killer details. Guys, click on the link in the description box below. Watch my five-minute video. Watch as we begin to build you a team and see if what I'm telling you is true. I think you'll be very excited. I think you'll understand about entrepreneurship and about building a business and what it takes. And I would be more than happy, more than happy to have you on my team and have you part of our training group and just show you exactly how to solve some of those financial problems that you're having. Man, thanks again for watching the video. We'll see you tomorrow night, guys. Remember, it's about prospecting. Bye-bye.